Mm. My time at Porsche. Gameplay. Yeah. What so, do you think? So far, I really enjoy it. I was expecting Stardew Valley, and I was um, surprised in a good way that it was more on the crafting side, like collecting and yeah, crafting. I think it's. Yeah. I like that. I like that it's a really chill game. Yeah. And it's kind of like Stardew Valley, but in 3D. <laughs> yeah, also that. <laughs> I'm going to rate it simple and give it a... Give it a 7. Yeah. yeah. So I, I don't love the game, but it's I would totally play it. Yeah. I think as far as we have played, I feel like it's... <laughs> It's different, but it's still comparable to like a mix of Animal Crossing and Stardew Valley. Yeah. I rated uh, an 8, mm. I think, in gameplay. Um, the story? In these types of games, you get to experience the gameplay first, yeah. and then the story is like second. Mm. The story is after you have like gotten the hang of the controls and yeah, what the game is about mm. like gameplay wise not yeah. story wise so the story is kind of secondary but it's still one of the main things as long as you play for long enough because it's hard to get into a story at least for me yeah when it's not something exciting and then i have to play for a long time to actually care about the story yeah, i'm just gonna give price. the story i don't know it five like it's it's mm. there it's it's fine <laughs> i think the voice acting and stuff it could be better definitely but <laughs> the fact that it's actually there mm. i feel like it immerses you a little bit more yeah i think i'll give it a six you're always it's... more generous than me it depends on the game art design and graphics I'm actually really impressed so far. Mm. I feel like they could have, well, filled out the empty areas a bit more. Mm. But that's the only thing that I can think of as a negative. Like the, the character looks really nice. It's customizable and it still still <laughs> looks like a human after you've done the <laughs> customizing yourself. Often I feel like you break the character when you try yeah. to do it yourself but yeah. yeah so it's really nice and you can definitely break your character if you want yep i think the interface all of it is just it's good it's yeah. nice it's easy i think i'm gonna give it a eight maybe yeah i was thinking an eight as well yeah i will yeah i think that's fair yeah, I mean, it's not no. the most amazing graphics, but it's it's perfect for this <laughs> kind of game. Yeah. Challenge. I, I think it's hard to rate the challenge. <laughs> I feel like you play this game not for the challenge, yeah, but for... Yeah, it's for relaxing and yeah. it's taking it easy. It's kind of like Star Valley. Yeah, and f for me, who doesn't like challenge, I really enjoy it. It's, I think it's perfect. I'm going to give the challenge a nine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I would rated a six because it's totally fine to just relax and stuff there isn't much if there is any challenge at all yeah and that is totally fine total score i think this is a seven mm. it's a game that i could set on and just mm. play for a weekend or and also if I... we could play it together I, in this game, since it doesn't have much of a challenge, I have to set my own goals. Yeah. And <laughs> I would definitely play until those goals are reached. I was thinking 7 too. Okay, yeah. Sort of for the same reasons, like, that's what I rated the gameplay. I feel like gameplay is the main thing here. Like, not the story, not the challenge. Like, the art design stuff is just a bonus. Um, yeah, I think I think seven is a fair score based like on the, on the total of the game yeah. and what it gives. Is it worth it? You said thirty dollars. Thirty bucks. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Sure. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, but 
you know, if you could buy it on sale, you should do that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I'm gonna say yes, even if it is full price, because you could pour hours and hours into this game. Yeah, that's and true. If you know that and this is like, if this is your kind of game, then yes, definitely. Yeah. You would have like more than enough value. Oh, like per hour. I would say that if you like Stardew Valley and you have played Stardew Valley, play that first. I feel like that's a better game, uh, but it's kind of similar. Mm. And if you like that kind of game, the gathering and maybe even build a community like in Animal Crossing, mm. if you like that kind of game, then it's worth it. But for me, I would only buy this on sale. And you probably did. And I probably did. <laughs> <laughs>